Hello again everyone, Box Salesman here with the Underground Sea Map boss. This boss is our glorious overlord Kuduku, and he just stands there and shoots sparks at you. So this fight is by definition just a face tank fight as he just stands there, uh, but you can take a few preparations. Um, there's quite a few options actually, you could use a topaz flasks uh, to counter the, the just the lightning damage by upping your max resist. You could use any flasks that dispel shock. You could use Fairgrave Strikehorn, it's a unique that makes you immune to shock. Or if you're a build that's dual wield or a shield, so if you have block chance, you can use this amulet with cha uh, block chance applied to spells. And you can also use Rainbow Strikes with uh, block chance applied to spells. So that's a lot of options uh, that I listed, so I'll just go into the fight. One last thing though, you can recognize the boss room because the room gets a little bit bigger than the normal tunnel, and there's always like a little wall in front. So, I know the Kuduku will be here, and yeah, I'll just be face tanking him because that's what you need to do. And keep uh, just look at your shock stacks though. If you have something to remove them, use it at the right time, or if you don't, run for your life as soon as you get more than one shock stack. And depending on the build, even run when you only have one shock stack. So that was pretty easy now, because I have this amulet. Without this amulet this would have actually been quite a lot harder, because it has really amazing synergy with Aegis Aurora. But I'm rambling on, so I'll leave you with this. Bye!